Niels Bohr is a pioneering physicist whose work shaped our understanding of atomic structure and quantum mechanics. Bohr's contributions have had a lasting impact on modern science and his story is one of intellectual brilliance and curiosity. Niels Henrik David Bohr was born on October 7, 1885, in Copenhagen, Denmark. He grew up in an academic family. His father was a professor of physiology at the University of Copenhagen, and his mother came from a prominent Jewish banking family. Growing up in an intellectually stimulating environment, Niels developed a passion for science and mathematics at an early age. Bohr studied at the University of Copenhagen, where he excelled in physics. In 1911, he earned his doctorate with a dissertation on the electron theory of metals. His work caught the attention of prominent physicists, and he soon moved to England to work with J.J. Thomson, who had discovered the electron, and later with Ernest Rutherford at the University of Manchester. While working with Rutherford, Bohr developed his revolutionary model of the atom. Building on Rutherford's model, Bohr proposed his revolutionary theory of atomic structure in 1913. He suggested that electrons orbit the nucleus in specific energy levels or shells, and that electrons could jump between these levels by absorbing or emitting energy in the form of photons. This idea introduced the concept of quantized energy levels, which became a cornerstone of quantum mechanics. The Bohr model was a major advancement in physics and earned him the 1922 Nobel Prize in Physics. One of Bohr's most significant contributions was the Copenhagen interpretation of quantum mechanics. The Copenhagen interpretation posits that particles, such as electrons, don't have definite properties until they are observed. Instead, they exist in a state of probability, described by a wave function, until measurement forces them into a specific state. This idea was a radical departure from classical physics and led to intense debates among scientists, including Albert Einstein, who famously remarked, God does not play dice with the universe. During World War II, Bohr played a crucial role in the scientific community's response to the discovery of nuclear fission. In 1943, he fled Nazi-occupied Denmark and eventually made his way to the United States, where he contributed to the Manhattan Project, where he worked alongside other prominent physicists like Robert Oppenheimer and Enrico Fermi to develop the atomic bomb. Despite his involvement, Bohr was deeply concerned about the ethical implications of nuclear weapons and advocated for international control of atomic energy. After the war, Bohr returned to Denmark and continued to influence both science and policy. He was a strong advocate for peaceful uses of nuclear energy and international cooperation in science. In 1955, he helped establish CERN, the European Organization for Nuclear Research which became one of the world's leading centers for scientific research. Bohr passed away on November 18, 1962, but his legacy lives on. His contributions to atomic theory, quantum mechanics, and his philosophical insights have left an indelible mark on the field of physics.